Hello everyone, eto na naman ako para bibigay sa inyo ng konting idea tungkol sa mga bagay-bagay. By the way, this is Mark Recto and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video guys, ang gagawin natin naman is mag-unbox tayo ng product. Ipapakita ko rin sa inyo dito yung features ng product at saka yung kanyang advantages and benefits na makukuha natin tungkol sa product na to. Tamang-tama tong product na to sa panahon ngayon since may pandemic and then ang kailangan, kailangan natin talaga to. So, ito na umpisa na natin. Ngayon guys, ang gagawin natin is mag-unbox tayo and uh, ito po yung i-unbox natin. Ayan. This is the Breville Juice Fountain Max. I got this product from a Breville Philippines distributor. So, umpisa na natin yung pag-unbox. Yes, ito na siya guys. Well, ito po siya guys. Ayan, ba't nakabalot pa siya? So, umpisa na natin yung pag-unbox. By the way, this is the Breville Juice Fountain Max. Breville Juice Fountain Max. Ayan. Model code niya is BJE40. So, let's start. First is, meron siyang manual. So, dito, magiging guide nyo on how to operate the product. Very simple lang naman yung pag-operate sa kanya. And also, the good thing about, about this manual is it comes with recipes at the back. So, may mga tips din siya for juicing. And then, yung mga fruits and vegetables facts nakalagay din dito about uh, the different types of fruits and vegetables and their facts and benefits for for us and here are the recipes at the back okay next is meron siyang jug this cup jug has a 1000 ml capacity and the next one, brush for cleaning. And this is the main unit. By the way, disclaimer lang guys, this is not a sponsored video. So, wala pong nag-utos or nagbayad sa akin para gawin to. Trip ko lang to. Nagustuhan ko kasi dito sa product na to is good sa yung brand niya kasi alam naman natin pag Breville is or one of the high-end brand. Kaya no worries tayo na magka problema sa unit. So, ito na po yung mga parts niya. And then, this. This is the blade. So, ito yung uh, pinagmamalaki ng Breville sa juicer nila. Na ginamit nila sa blade. Which is hindi katulad sa ibang juicer. Later, i-explain ko sa inyo. Ang maganda dito sa product na to is very convenient siya and then uh, easy to assemble disassemble and then easy to clean then yung mga parts isa isa natin is ito yung juice collector niya so of course yung main motor juice collector so this is the patented titanium reinforced nutridis so ito yung pinagmamalaki ng breville since hindi sila gumagamit ng stainless lang na blade, which is ginagamit nila is a titanium blade. So, bukod sa matibay siya, 
maganda pa siya sa health natin kaya nakalagay sa box nila is 70% more nutrients dahil ito yung blade na nakakatulong to produce 70% more nutrients. Bakit? Isa sa kalaban kasi ng nutrient ng fruits and vegetables is yung heat. Ang mayayari kasi, pag sta regular stainless lang, once na umikot siya ng mabilis, magpo-produce siya ng heat through friction. So, ang mangyayari nun is nababawasan po yung nutrients ng fruits and vegetables. Aha, di ba? May idea na kayo. So, ngayon dito, since titanium ang gamit natin, lesser heat transfer siya sa fruits and vegetables, kaya nakakaproduce siya ng 70% more nutrients. Ang pagkabit, papatong lang natin yung juice collector. Next is the blade. It comes with an arrow to guide you where, it, where to put it. And then, press down to lock. It, since it's magnetic, so it's easy to lock. See? And then, the next one is the top cover. Let's put it in place. And then, this is the safety lock. We'll just lock it here. It's just that easy. And then, the next one is the pulp collector. So, we just put the pulp collector in here. And this is the picture with a 1000 ml capacity. You just put it here. Pero kung konti lang naman yung gagawin mo, like uh, for one person to lang gagawin mo, or sa tumbler mo naglagay, or sa baso, all you need to do is to use this spout, rubber spout. So, lagay mo lang siya dito, and then pwede mo na ilagay yung baso mo dito. But if you're going to use the pitcher, you just need to remove this. Yan. So, ganun lang siya kadali assemble. And uh, one feature pa na maganda dito sa kanya is meron siyang 84mm wide feed tube. So, it's lesser of food preparation. So, ang gagawin lang natin dito is i-wash lang natin yung fruits and vegetables. And then, since 84mm wide feed tube siya, kasya na natin ilagay ng bu even buong apple. So, hassle-free tayo sa preparation. And this comes with an 13,000 RPM. So, sa speed niyang yun, mas unlike the other juicers, makapansin nyo, pag nag-juice kayo, is basa pa yung pulp. Dito, Ang maganda sa kanya is yung outcome, mas medyo mas drier siya yung pulp. And then mostly is juice yung napoproduce. So it comes with two speed control. It's here. So, if i-click mo siya sa upper, it says the upper one is for the low speed. It's used for the soft fruits and vegetables. Pag nilagay mo naman siya sa baba, yun naman po yung high speed. So, mostly used for the hard fruits and vegetables like uh, sugar cane, carrots, turmeric, yun, yung mga hard to juice type na mga fruits and vegetables. Dito, easy easy lang siyang gawin. Pag, pagdating naman po sa cleaning, very easy lang din. So, madaling madali lang siyang linisin. So, kung baga ideal itong juicer na to sa mga busy person especially or sa mga panahon nga na lagi tayo nagmamadali, maganda dito sa kanya is uh, hindi na siya mag-take ng lots of time, preparation, and then cleaning. So, easy lang. So, gagawin lang natin pag lilinisin na natin siya. Siyempre, remove lang natin si pitcher. And then, unlock. Lip lang natin ito. Yung juice collector. That's it. So, dito kukunasan lang natin. Hindi natin kailangan hugasan to Since wala namang masyadong natatapon dito na liquid. So, ito is covered yung ilalim niya. So, safe siya. Hindi natatapon yung liquid. And then, dadali na natin siya sa lababo. Ang gagawin natin, using the brush, tatapat lang natin sa grip. So, syempre, tapat lang natin siya, like ito, and then brush-brush lang natin. Especially this, brush lang natin, ganun siya kadali. 
So, hassle-free din yung cleaning niya. And also guys, pagdating naman sa pulp collector, kung ayaw nyo naman na i-reuse yung mga pulp, so the easiest way para hindi nyo na siya hugasan pa, para hindi nyo na siya hugasan pa yung pulp collector, nalagyan nyo na siya ng plastic liner dito. Kukover nyo siya ng plastic bago nyo siya ilagay dito. The purpose of it is para after nyo siya mag-juice, remove nyo na lang si plastic, then pwede nyo na itapon. So hindi na tayo maghugas pa ng pulp collector. So that's it for now. Sa susunod naman na video, abangan nyo, is gagawa tayo ng juice recipe using this Breville Juice Fountain Max. etong si Breville kasi is uh, mostly recommended din siya dahil nga sa features na meron siya, unlike the other juicers. So, yun nga sinasabi ko, yung feature niya like yung blade na ginagamit nila, since a patented titanium reinforced nutri dish siya, so yun nakakatulong para makapag-absorb yung katawan natin ng more nutrients. So, hindi niya nasisira yung mga nutrients ng fruits and vegetables. Actually, kaya nagustuhan ko yung nga itong product na to. And thank you at na-deliver na rin sa akin. So, guys, kung gusto niyo maging healthy, mag-juicing na rin kayo. Sa next next video natin, is ipapakita ko sa inyo yung juice recipe na gagawin ko dito gamit ang Breville Juice Fountain Max. So, that's it for now. For, see you on the next video and please don't forget to click the subscribe and the tiny bell button and also if nagustuhan nyo tong video na to click the thumbs up button please thank you for watching